Good morning, everyone. We are live in the kitchen with Chef Pacini, and I wish you guys had television yes. to smell how amazing it smells in here. And we have a bit of salty and sweet going on this morning. Chef, talk to us about what you're cooking up right now. So now I'm doing a Creole scramble. I'm taking some andouille sausage, some hot links, some diced ham. I've rendered that down. I got it, yeah, some of the fat cooked out of it. So it's going to be a little, have a little bit more of a snap, a little bit better mouthfeel. We've taken some what's called the Trinity. It's uh, diced onions, bell peppers, and celery. We've cooked that, sweat that in a little butter, and then we've scrambled up some eggs. Ooh. And is uh, there any seasoning, chef, on these? Those, everything is sweet, seasoned with my Creole blend, which is going to have some obey, some uh, cayenne, salt, pepper, garlic, a little Italian seasoning. Mm. Um, so that's all of this. And then we also roasted some, some potatoes. Here and we've done this. We've done the same thing with these. We've actually put a little bit of our Creole rub on here. It smells so good. And so we're gonna. I've put been told absolutely not to touch this. <laughs> Just came out of the oven, no, right? No. Yeah, it came out of a 400 degree oven, so okay. I probably don't want you touching that. Okay. So we can do this a couple of ways. Uh, if you got picky kids at home and you don't want to combine everything, then you do everything separate like this, and then you That's can serve idea. it that way. Um, now, if you're cooking just for dad, and, and your dad's like me, then you take everything and it all goes... I was going to say, just throw in those yep. veggies in there. <laughs> yep. It all goes together into the pan. And what else is nice about this dish is it has good color. The contrast is good, so it obviously... Great it note. Good. Lots of different colors. Yeah. I love that. Yep. Well, and what, what dad doesn't like meat and potatoes? Who so. doesn't like meat and potatoes? Meat and potatoes <laughs> in the morning. Yeah. Right? Meat and potatoes at lunch and dinner as well, but why not in the morning? So we're going to take all that, we're going to just bring it all together. Mm. And what do you call this dish when it's all said and done? This is a, I call this a Creole scramble. Okay. Um, it's, it's a hev heavily Louisiana-based type of cooking mm -hmm. um, where you're taking, again, andouille sausage, a lot of spice, a lot of American spices. And you're bringing that all together, and we're just going to put well, that right. for those fathers who may not be <laughs> meat eaters, who are vegetarians, just leave out the sausage. Right? Leave out the sausage, sure. Um, absolutely. That's good too, Connie. Or you could, you know, really, if you want to make it a California scramble, you would just add uh, some mushrooms and Smell some and avocado, and some fresh avocado yes. on top. Absolutely. So we did a little Creole scramble there for you with a little roasted potatoes. You got everything potatoes. in there. You got your carbs, your protein, yep. your veggies. And how long does that take all together to prep, would you say? Total prep time on this is about 15 minutes. Okay. Uh, you got to dice some vegetables and, and get that ready. Um, and then just kind of let everything cook. So you Chef, want to make it look easy. I, I know like my husband, he doesn't like spicy foods. Can this sausage be spicy? The, uh, both of these, the hot links and the andouille, tend to... Tend to lose, be on the more, be spicy, on the more spicy side. So, what can people cook with if they're not uh, spicy fans? Actually, locally, Saladino's has an Italian sausage. They have a sweet Italian that is amazing, okay. and they're a locally owned okay. company right here in Fresno. Mm. So, Saladino's has a great Italian you could use. Um, if you don't like that, just do the ham. Okay, oh, that's a good idea. Really okay. quick, if you weren't with us last hour, we made this dish right here. Really quickly, you want to yeah. give us a recap of this one, Chef? Yeah, that's that's my stuffed pan perdu. Pan perdu in Creole means mm. French toast. Uh, what we've done is we've taken our artisan hala and we've cut it, we've filled it with cream, a sweetened right. cream cheese. Wow. We've dipped it in our egg wash, which was eggs, milk, bourbon, a little vanilla. Can I serve this up to uh, Anthony <laughs> Bailey and just say happy, happy Father's, Father's Day? Day. <laughs> Alex, and I made it. Alex and I made it for him. Yeah, I don't really believe that. Anthony's worth it. He's a good guy. <laughs> yeah, he is a good guy. Uh, and really quick, what do we have over here? It looks like cinnamon rolls. Well, you know... The one more one more way for me to make me happy, make me cinnamon rolls on Father's Day. Uh, so this is what I call my dad's cinnamon roll. It's a real easy recipe. It actually only takes an hour start to finish. Really? Unlike a lot of traditional cinnamon rolls. And then we finish it with a bourbon glaze. Mm -hmm. So we take powdered sugar, a little milk, uh, and a little bit of bourbon. We mix that up, and straight out of the oven, you put that glaze over the top. So Chef, you've got the bourbon in both the French toast and the cinnamon roll. Yep. That is what's going to make a lot of dads happy on Sunday. Yeah, I like bourbon because it's an American original, right? Bourbon is yeah. actually an American original. It, it comes from Kentucky. Yeah. Um, and the smokiness of the, the smoke barrels and then the oak flavor that you get brings some natural honey and some mm -hmm. natural sweetness to it and nuttiness to it. So how can you not like bourbon in America? And the alcohol is already <laughs> cooked down, so yeah. it's safe for little kids to eat. Absolutely. Right. Yeah. And, and the pan Purdue, especially since we put heat, most of the alcohol is going to evaporate out. And then in the cinnamon roll, you're looking at two teaspoons. It's not enough to affect anybody. Okay.
You can just have Not that enough one for, <laughs> for a good time eating it alone. Yeah. That's fine. Two teaspoons over 20, uh, 12 portions, that's pretty minimal. Yeah, yeah it is. Good. This just looks, smells fantastic. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank, Thank you. We so appreciate it. And happy early Father's yes. Day to Thank you as you. well. Absolutely. I hope someone makes you this. You need a break from cooking on Sunday. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Chef. Appreciate it.